brand new Motorola Zoom announced at CES. It's the world's first Android 3.0 honeycomb tablet. Completely re-engineered for a tablet, complete new software, and also best-in-class hardware. So this is a dual-core processor, as well as one gigabyte of RAM. So it really is the combination of world-class software and hardware. Also has a 10.1-inch HD display. So this is a full HD display, just like repping my plasma screen off the wall and taking it with me. We've got some uh, videos here that we can take you through, show you some of the cool new experiences. Basically, all of the Google services have been overhauled for Honeycomb. Give you an example of the web browsing experience. So, new features within the web browser. Firstly, I have the scrollable widgets on my home screen, which I have on multiple different widgets. That gets me directly to the pages I want. I can tap up with a virtual keyboard or indeed a wireless keyboard that we've developed and then open it in a new tab. So I have multi-tab browsing for the first time on Android, getting it more and more like the PC web browsing experience. Obviously supports Adobe Flash, the expect from uh, Motorola and Android. So full inline web browsing with video. Any questions I can ask? I've got thumbnail views uh, of all my favorite websites, which is beautiful touch screen environment. And then the other cool new feature we've added is the Cognito mode, which enables me to switch off my browsing history. A lot of people use their tablets around their families or whatever, so you can switch off the browsing history. Obviously, beautiful display like this, we want beautiful content, so you'll be able to watch HD uh, quality movies, play back uh, in 16 by 9 format, fills the screen as Hollywood makes those movies, over a million pixel display, so very crisp, rich. What is the actual resolution? The resolution is 1280 by 800, so actually 16 by 10, but then movies are rendered in 16 by 9. So you can get a few of the sense for the... Uh, some other cool new services that have been uh, overhauled for the tablet. The new Google eBooks st uh, service, which was recently announced. Again, really is built for the touch environment. I have this beautiful carousel of all the thumbnails of my books that I've downloaded. And then I sync those books to my Google account, just like I do contacts and email. So that if I go to my Android smartphone or indeed my web uh, site, I can get to those books. Again, scrollable uh, widgets. So any books that I have in here, I just tap through, open up, and start reading exactly where I left it. Yeah, I read that on my smartphone on my PC. Beautiful environment. It will rotate into portrait and landscape. Doesn't do it on this uh, current screen. Brings up Google Books. Google Maps is uh, really cool on the tablet as well. So this is Google Maps 5.0, uh, all touch enabled. New vector based maps, so you'll see a much smoother uh, navigation as I move around uh, Google Maps. So if I go into uh, Times Square here, over 100 cities in the US have already been data encrypted to get these building views. And as I move my hands, I really can rotate the around. The capability of the processing power. I mean, really, I mean, and then with another really cool feature on the tablet is if I click and go into Street View, again I can use touch to pinch and zoom Street View. And then it's going to have the ability to see the upgrade. So that's Google Maps. Uh, because I have a front-facing camera here, I can also do video chat right from the Motorola Zoom. So if I go into uh, G-Talk, any of my contacts that also have a webcam facility I see with a green uh, webcam, and away I'll go uh, video chat. Obviously I can then pick it up, hand it around. Uh, that's available over Wi-Fi and the 3G service. And what else can we show you here? Let's also show you YouTube, which is another service that's been overhauled for the tablet. Again, we have scrollable widgets right on my home screen, so I can flick through to see what the latest postings are on uh, YouTube, and then click to open or go via the usual uh, icon. I have thumbnail view of uh, YouTube, which I scroll through with my fingers. Completely new uh, interface uh, for tablets. <laughs> cool 
app, search, search Android. Find the one that I like. And then more and more of, uh, video content on YouTube is high quality, high quality fill the screen. I'll watch it uh, right on the so that's a brief, a brief overview of the Motorola Zoom um, coming to North America with Verizon in Q1 uh, with 3G and then will be upgradable to 4G in Q2. Thank you.